called Main Alley. We're going to be headed all the way down, so get used to this alleyway, although it might get rerouted by construction, who knows. This is a piece done by an artist that is quite often mistaken for and compared to Banksy. So Banksy, we could probably all agree, is the most famous street artist in the world, does all the stencil work all over the world. This is not Banksy, this is done by Vancouver's version of Banksy. He goes by the name of iHeart, and it's very similar, it does the stencil based work and it's all providing a social commentary on our ever evolving relationship with social media. There's four different iHeart pieces in this neighborhood. We're gonna be seeing three of them on this tour, so this is the first one we see, and then as we walk along, we'll see the last one and you'll know we're almost at the end of the tour because we'll have seen all three. So it's like I spy iHeart the whole, the whole tour we go. And this one is called Failure to Communicate. Unfortunately, Volp got to it. I don't know, Volp, Volp. It, so it has been tagged over. This one was first done in 2016, so in the first year of Mural Fest, and actually the first year they had it done, uh, it got completely graffitied over, so they had to actually get iHeart to come back and do it again. But Mural Fest is partnered with a company called Goodbye Graffiti, and so they'll put on this graffiti deterrent code on it to try and not have this happen, but uh, obviously it hasn't quite been able to be maintained perfectly. Mural Fest is responsible for the upkeep and maintenance of the murals for two years after it's first completed and then after those two years it's the responsibility of the building owner so it really does depend the lifespan on a mural based off of how much the building owner is going to be upkeeping it and working to make sure that it's not getting tagged over who knows maybe iheart would like it maybe it's a whole other level of social commentary of it right um we're going to talk about this piece down here we'll talk a little bit more about the upkeep of murals as well